How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today we're playing LSPDFR and today we are playing with the South Carolina State Trooper Pack and um, this I gotta say this is a really nice vehicle. I, I did do a South Carolina Highway Patrol last episode and uh, most of y'all seem to like it. I did get a comp or a suggestion for it I should say uh, in the comments and I did fulfill that suggestion so um, and I gotta say they look pretty nice. I'm, I'm not mad at it. Um, I didn't think they'd look all that great, but they definitely do. I wonder why that guy's stopping. That's kind of weird. Um, but we're going to get into today today's patrol. We're going to see what we get into. I also got a suggestion to kind of hang around Fort Zancudo a little bit. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Uh, Route 68 area. All that stuff. And uh, we'll definitely see what we get into. Maybe run into some radar. We'll just have to see. All right, so I'm just gonna be doing some standard plate checks. Whoa, what's this guy doing? We're gonna get a plate check on him. This dude's kind of driving weird. Target license plate. Four, three, John, Mary. Felony William, warrant. Three, three. Oh my gosh. A warrant issued. Proceed with caution. Dang, he's driving crazy too. I don't know if it's like a glitch because he thinks I have my lights on, but, or if that's just the way he's driving because he's intoxicated. Um. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a felony stop today. Let's go ahead and slow down traffic. And uh, call some backup. And people were asking me if I did use ultimate backup and uh, police smart radio. And yes, I do. Actually, I do use um, both of those things for the person who asked in the comments. Required on uh, Route 68. And uh, yep, there he comes. We're going to have uh, four units total today. Bobcat 4, we're in route. I'm not going to make contact with the driver until my units get here, at least two of them. I'm right here, dispatch. I'll check it out. Alright. Oh, where's my gun? Where is my gun? Uh-oh. Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. I think I, I think I have to turn on my radar or something. That's weird. Anyway, we're going to get him out. I forgot I didn't have my radar on. I don't think anyone else is in the vehicle. Is the vehicle clear, guys? Oh, let's just hope so. I'm gonna go in for the arrest. I'm gonna swoop around here. Actually, no, he will. Okay. Vehicle looks pretty clear to me. Just gonna do a last final check. Alright, vehicle's clear. Yeah, this was a good- oh man, this looks nice. Uh, let me go ahead and stop traffic completely. Just so these guys can either get out of the way or I don't know what they're gonna do. Dang, we got a lot of units here. We got a total of four, including mine, six. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I recently, and they're all Crown Vicks as well. All right. I recently just added uh, that vehicle right there. I gotta say it looks pretty nice. Who is, is it this person? Is it you? Is it? Come on, turn off your siren. I really don't know whose siren's on. It better not be mine. Anyway. Uh, ma'am, what you got on you? Everything illegal on you? I don't know. Check for myself. All right. Uh, do you have a cons do I have consent to search your person? Well, you just said check my for myself. Uh, would you like a female officer present? You really don't care. Okay. All right, partner, you want to perform the search? All right, cool. My buddy's going to perform the search as I go kill the person with their lights or the sirens on. All right, guys, I got him to turn off his siren. Uh, we still got to take care of this lady right here. All right, ma'am, is there anything in the vehicle I need to know about? No? Okay, nothing in the vehicle? All right, I'm going to search it real quick. Hang tight. She didn't have anything on her, so I really don't think she has anything in the vehicle yet. Um, but she does seem intoxicated. We did get some uh, indications that she may be intoxicated. So my buddy's going to do a breathalyzer test. And if that comes up negative, then we're going to do a narcotics test. Hey, uh, buddy, you're going to be good to go, all right? I just need your vehicle to clear out. Okay, she's not intoxicated, which means I'm gonna do a drug swab test just to be 100% certain that she's okay. 
All right, uh, buddy, can you do a drug swab test real quick, please? We're gonna get traffic to slow it down just because it's still an active crime scene. Thank you kindly. Uh, she's positive for cocaine. Okay, well, that's tragic. All right, buddy, can you go ahead and take her in your vehicle down there? That'd be great. Assistance required on um, Route 68. All right, perfect. He's gonna take her, and uh, he'll, he'll do the paperwork, he said. While I tow the vehicle. And there we go. Flatbed, assistance required on Route 68. Simple as that. And, uh, dispatch, show me 10-8. There we that. go. Alright guys, I decided to uh, run the radar right here. Um, I set the speed limit speedometer for 60 because the speed limit area in this area is 55. Um, so I'm leaving that 5 mile per hour gap. So far everyone's done pretty well. I haven't really gotten... Oh! As I say that, just like the last video, as I say that, something pops up. Alright, we're going to run that again just to confirm it. We're going to go ahead and get a plate check from dispatch, which he doesn't have a plate on this thing, from what I can tell. Might be somewhere else. Oops. Ah, that didn't happen. No one saw that. And let's see. Plate. Eight, seven, John, Union, yep. Lincoln, two, five, a warrant issued. All right, we're going to get him to pull off to the right, and, uh, I don't know, felony warrant, so it's not just a misdemeanor warrant, it's an actual felony warrant. We'll check out that in a bit more detail and see, um, exactly what that warrant is for. Uh, okay. So he's supposed to be mimicking me. All right, that, that should be good enough. That right there should be fine. Um, let's go ahead and check what that felony warrants for. I don't want to bring in all that off, all those officers again. Um, possession of fentanyl. Okay. He did. Oh, what man? His arrest record is pretty hefty. Uh, warrant for bank robbery. Uh, I don't even know how to say that. Something. Warrant strong armed. Robbery, witness intimidation, warrant aggravated assaults. Yeah, he's had his fair share of warrants there. Um, so yeah, I'm going to call him maybe just for like one unit, one or two units to back me up here. Backup required on um, Great Ocean Highway. Yeah, let's get some units down here. I don't want to go out full code, code 5 to stop. Uh, I did see his record, but th this um, this type of situation isn't too too threatening to officers. Oh look at that! I didn't even notice that. On these vehicles, they have a little state trooper. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's a nice addition there. I think I called for two units, right? Maybe not. Let's go and get him out of the vehicle for starters. All right, man. Hey, go step out of the vehicle, all right? Hold on a sec. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna go ahead and place you under arrest. All right, you're just being detained for now. Uh, from what I could tell, you do have a warrant on your record, so for my safety and yours, you are being detained at this time. Do you know about any warrant on your record? No, you have no idea. All right. So just for my safety and his, like An I said, in need of I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put him in cuffs. All right, show me on a 1011. Oh, I forget that they don't register 1011. Show me on a traffic stop. There we go. 10 four, copy one Adam 18. Approach with caution. All right, man, you have anything illegal on you? Nope. Alright. Um. Trying to look for the warrant thing. 
Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. You're not under arrest for your being detained. Are you any aware, are you aware of any, uh, warrants? Nope, okay. Well, what's your name, man? My buddy's gonna go ahead and search you, alright? We're gonna find, uh, we're gonna find an ID in there. Let's hope so. A Christian Shocker. Alright, I think that's the guy that it said that was warrant wanted. Let's go ahead and request a pet check. Yep, okay. At this time, you are being placed under arrest for an outstanding warrant, uh, possession of fentanyl. Um, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to you. Do you understand these rights as I read them to you? Alright, perfect. Um, alright, well, I don't really have any further questions for you. My buddy here might, so, um, that, that'd be it. Uh, I will be writing your, uh, arrest report today. So, once my buddy takes you, so, hey, can you go ahead and take him, alright? Assistance required on, uh, Great Ocean Highway. Alright, let me go and slow down traffic here, because it's not really safe for me to just be running out of traffic like this. Let's search the vehicle and see what we find. We might be adding up some charges here. A little bit. An urn of ashes and a crowbar. I don't know what he had on him. I can't remember what it said. Dialogue. Let's check that. Nope. Notifications. Um. He had a binocular and a... Binoculars and a flashlight. Okay. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how we're going to get this thing towed out of here. Uh, we could probably just call the insurance company because it is a company vehicle. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, don't get my vehicle. I'm glad they ask you. Because sometimes I accidentally do that. Assistance required right. in Chumash. There we go. They'll go, they'll go and uh, take the vehicle away. And that'll be it. Let's go ahead and write this, uh, this report here. Alright, Christian Shocker. I believe that's how you say the last name. Why can't I view the owner record? Oh, is it because that guy took him already? Well, that, that stinks. Alright. Alright, well, apparently I can't do that. That's kind of a bummer. Um, okay, once the insurance agent picks it up, I'm gonna go ahead and take off out of here. Alright, don't drive crazy, okay? I'm trusting that you have, uh, the proper license to drive that thing. Ooh. Anyway. Hold on. Show me 10 eight. Copy that. One, Adam. Eighteen. Proceed with patrol. Shot fired in Tongva Hills. Oh, well, that's that's convenient. Okay. Um, we're gonna head down there. Show me in route. Ten four. Copy. One, Adam. All right. 18. It's a little over a mile away. Respond code three. And uh, it is a heavily armored gunman. Witness saw a heavily armored gunman walking with the firearm. All right. So, I think I have seen these calls on, uh, if y'all watch, like, Jeff Fabiano or Steve the Gamer and all that stuff. Maybe you've seen this type of call before, but I think this call is pretty cool. We'll check it out, though. I think I've only done it once before, so we'll see how it goes. Alright, so we're kind of showing up on scene here. Uh, he's in this big yellow circle. So he could be anywhere around here. He could be up there, he could be down here. We don't know at this point, but if he is on that little hill, I want to make sure we get the high ground, so. I went ahead and shut off my sirens just because I don't want him to, like, get scared. Okay. Alright, panic button, panic, panic, panic. That Holy crap, required. I'm probably gonna die. Uh, I am probably gonna die. This is harder than it looks, holy crap. Dispatch, Ocean 1 here, we can take that if no one else wants it. Where is he, where is he, where is he? Did he fall off the cliff? Adam 4, copy. Okay, yeah, the, this pistol ain't, oh, seriously, seriously, oh no, oh my gosh. That, that Hummer killed me right there. That Alrighty guys, it's gonna wrap it up for today's video. Hope y'all enjoyed. 
If you did, make sure to smash the like button. If you didn't, you already know what to do. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I post content like this pretty often, so make sure to check it out by turning on post notifications so you never miss a video and you always get notified. And uh, if you're new, also leave suggestions down below. I guess not just if you're new, but anyone can leave suggestions down below. I look at those suggestions, believe it or not. And uh, sometimes I'll actually leave a little heart and comment back saying that I'll use it uh, in a future video and that I like the idea if it is a good idea. Um, but other than that, that's going to wrap it up, y'all. Steven out.